after returning your ballot in person, dropping it off at a drop box or sending it in by mail. It goes through a multi-step process to be counted, including signature verification. Election ballots are pouring into election offices across the country, including here at the Sacramento County Elections Office. They're getting stacked. Check. They wanted this one. Prep for processing and the signature test. It's here where trained workers verify what's on the return envelope to the voters registration record. We also verify at that time that they haven't already voted anywhere else in California. Courtney Bailey Canelo says registrar of voters for Sacramento County. For education purposes, she allows our cameras to record as her signature is verified. It's their voter registration form, past registration forms, any sort of official form or document from our office can be used to validate a signature. Eyeballing ballots one by one, election workers look for a minimum of three identifying points. We look at pen pressure, we look at angle, we look at the size, we look at how you, how you cross your T's and dot your I's in order to determine whether or not it belongs to that voter. Even though it looks different, there's enough identifying points to let you know that that is me. If a signature is matched, the ballot moves on to be counted. If it can't be matched, Bailey Canelo says the ballot goes through a secondary review. If your signature doesn't match, we will reach out to you and it will give you time to fix your ballot even after election day. So we have until two days before we certify to get any sort of corrections back to us. Which means California voters have until December 1st to make and return those corrections. But Bailey Canelo says the sooner, the better. One vote really does make a difference. We've had city council contests that have been within three votes of each other a water district with eight votes of each other. So those votes really do make a difference. So please, even after election day, please don't disregard it. In Sacramento, Brittany Johnson, KCRA 3 News.